Meet Francisco. He manages sales and marketing for a company. It doesn't matter what kind of company. He has something in common with everyone in his shoes. He needs to drive customer revenue. And to do that, he needs to think about customer relationship management. Francisco can't afford to let valuable marketing leads fall through the cracks. He has recurring nightmares about that big account renewal. Is his team on the ball? Without a CRM, he has no clue. He's tried a number of CRMs, but every project has crashed and burned. Why? He could never get everyone to use the system. They complain that it was confusing, a waste of their time. Better to stick to spreadsheets, pen and paper. And if fallouts fails, the cerebral cortex. Everything his IT department had tried before was difficult to maintain, impossible to customize for specific business processes, and ridiculously buggy. So how could Zermo be any different than what he's tried before? First of all, let's talk about what matters most, people, users. Every single aspect of Zermo is designed to make using a CRM meaningful and pleasant experience. The user interface is clean and it makes sense. His team engages in a bit of friendly competition through gamification a concept that takes the points, badges, levels, and categories seen in traditional games and applies them to a non-traditional scenario. It turns an otherwise tedious task into an opportunity to get status, recognition, and respect. It's also kind of addicting. Zermo is the first CRM to build gamification into its foundation. They use Zermo to better communicate, collaborate in groups, and track and close deals. Francisco's IT people are happy with the integrity of Zermo's code, which is built using a geeky thing called test-driven development, a highly disciplined method of architecting software. It's also open source, which means the techies have free reign to make whatever changes they like. Now that's respect. Zermo is the next generation CRM that enchants Francisco's users and makes his software engineers blush.